Hi, I'm Paul from Pro Tools Expert. Today I'm going to look at the Avid 11 Mark II plugin. I was intrigued to see how similar it sounded to the 11 Rack. So I've set up a little test using the same settings on both. I've recorded the 11 Rack into Pro Tools using it as the interface. And I've also recorded the Guitar DI straight into the 11 Rack into Pro Tools. So they should sound the same. So for my first example, I'm going to be using one of my favourite amps in the 11 Rack, which is the 59 Tweed Bassman. I've got the same settings, the same cabinet, and I've turned off all of the effects on the 11 rack. And I've just added a small amount of reverb inside of Pro Tools just to create a bit of space. Now during the demo, I'm just going to switch between the plugin and the 11 rack. So let's start off with the plugin first. So let's hear how that sounds. <laughs> Now it is subtle, but there is a difference, and to my ears, the plug-in is brighter. It still sounds good, but the rack just feels a bit more natural. My second example is a Soldano model in the 11. As you can see, I've got the same settings on both, so let's hear the difference. And as before, we'll start first with the plug-in. <laughs> Now that to me is the greatest difference so far. I think the plug-in sounds a lot fizzier, it sounds a lot more like an amp simulator, while the rack sounds a lot more natural. My third example is the 64 Lux Vibrato, which is based on a Fender amp. And I chose this one because I wanted to compare the two tremolos between the plug-in and the rack. So again, we're going to start with the plug-in, and let's check that out. Now on that one, I quite like the plug-in version. I think it's a lot less subtle and they sound quite similar. Now lastly, I'm going to use the DC amp, the DC modern amp. And again, I'm going to be using the tremolo, but I'm also going to be cranking up the tremolo on this to use it on a very high setting. So let's hear that. And again, uh, we're going to use the, the plug-in first. <laughs> Try that again. Thank you. 
Now I like the new plugin, but does it sound the same? Well, it's pretty close, but I still prefer the sound of the rack. It's slightly less harsh, but those who don't own the rack, I think it's a great purchase, especially if you can go and get the pedal plugins as well. I'm Paul Drew from Pro Tools Expert. I hope you've enjoyed the video and I'll see you next time.